Coach Meyer said he's like it's not going to be Coach Beck's decision as far as who's going to be the strength. He said that wouldn't be fair to him. Yeah. That's, that, so you can kind of just sit back, let it all play out, and whoever's the, the starter is the starter. Yeah, absolutely. I wish it was that easy, right? <laughs> but uh, no, you know, I mean, I appreciate that. You know, it, it's uh, you know it's a blessed position, but a tough position. Great kids, great competitors, great athletes, and uh, we just got to come out and work and see who's going to be the most consistent throughout camp. You just told us Ohio State's not going to make an announcement until the Buckeyes take the field against Virginia Tech. So I think people are waiting for a timetable. Or yeah. When are you guys going to announce it? You guys aren't going to announce yeah, it. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't count on that. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't count on that. Tell me the, the strategy involved in that, just to keep obviously Virginia Tech on their toes a little bit. I know they came at Ohio State with a plan they weren't expecting last year. Is that the rationale behind that? Is just to uh, keep you know, guessing. It could be. I think more or less it's given the guys the opportunity to really compete. We're going to need every day. I mean, we're going to need every day to go out there, and there's probably going to be a time through the course of the season we're going to need both of them. Um, so to just settle on one and say, here's the keys, and the other guy just sits back and becomes a second-team guy, I don't know if that's the right thing to do. You know, I think the best thing to do is let him keep competing. Competition's a beautiful thing. It really keeps him focused. It keeps him working hard. And, uh, you know, the, the better guy at the end will, will come out and be in that guy. But certainly we're going to need the backup, too. Along those same lines, could there be a two-quarterback system? Is that even a possibility? I, I, I don't know. Yeah. yeah. I, I, mean, I, that, I mean, I really don't have one. So Coach Meyer said in the past that he's going to make an analytical decision. What are the things that you're looking for to, to, to make that decision as who's going to be the starter? Well, I mean, you're, you're taking into account everything that goes on through practice. and. Uh, leadership and you know just how who's moving the team who's not moving the team how are guys handling the football and ball security and making good decisions all those things that that can hurt a football team guys that don't do that and guys make plays guys gotta make plays too you know we can't just have a robot back there we got to have a guy that's a good athlete that can do some things so there's a lot that goes in it you know there's a lot that's going to go into the decision and and uh, all hands are on deck for it Tim, as you approach this, did you did you actually tell Cardale and JT like sort of what you expect of them? I mean, yeah. or you know, in a nutshell, what'd you tell them? Yeah, we just talked to them and just told them that, just yeah. kind of what I just said. You know, yeah. we're we're going to evaluate everything that they do, um, from from coming out here, demeanor, to how they handle themselves, how they handle the offense, in top in terms of completion percentage. I mean, the typical statistical analysis and data that you're going to get to be able to the hardcore facts, but even just the presence and leadership and the types of things. So all of it's going to be weighed into the decision, and they, and they are very aware of it. Tim, do you flip the coin beforehand? We did. We flipped the coin before practice. Flipped the <laughs> I flipped it. Who won? Cardell. He picked heads, and it was heads. How long, you gonna, how long will you need to do something like that? Throughout? It was just this. It was just who was going to take the field the first time when the first offense came out from here on out. We just switch them out um, throughout.